Hello and welcome to part three. As you can see, I done switched things up a little bit. I actually cut a few strips and I am stitching these stri strips together because I decided to add me, you know, a little braid, braided tassel down the side. So I basically stitched that and then once I stitched two of them together, I think it was about, it was a few pieces on each one. at least three enough to make the braid if you, you know you can add more add less depending on how thick you want it to be but anyway i took that and i braided it down and yeah i'm basically stuffing it in there leaving the outer part and i'm going to stitch that on the machine because when i turn it inside out is when i'm going to actually braid it so again, I just stuff it inside and leave the stitched part in between, sandwiched in between the edge. And I'm going to sew around that. And remember, we're going to sew around the entire perimeter. And I'm going to leave about two inches open for my part that I need to turn inside out. Again, we're going to always start with this uh, with back stitch. And we're going to end, and I'm going about one eighth to one fourth of an inch around it. Okay, I cut the extra notch off from the tassel because it was a little bulky. And as you can see, I'm trying to get a few other strings off. But once I turn it inside, right side out, you'll start seeing that I, you know, basically have like two caps in one, if that makes sense. So with the opening... I'm able to go ahead and situate my hat the way I want it. As you can see, I'm just kind of pressing that down. I'm going to add a few clips around there because I will be going around the outer perimeter with a stitch. You can, you know, do a few more if you like um, around other parts of it, but I'm just going to do the outer perimeter, perimeter, perimeter right now. I sound crazy. Let me drink some more coffee. But anyway, yeah. Okay, so again, once I finish, I just basically go ahead and braid these down. And when I get to the end of them, I kind of add like a little knot to it. And bam, that's it. That's all. This concludes this tutorial. And I'll see you guys in the next one.